All right. Uh, we're here in Christiansburg, Virginia at Duncan Imports. My buddy Mike is buying a Suzuki Cappuccino 91. I'm going to take you guys on a tour of all of the warehouses, of which this is one. There are over a thousand cars here, and I think something like $60 million worth of vehicles. AutoZam, AZ1, super rare with the turbo hood and turbo wheels. Nissan Figaro, we'll see more of those later. Um, a few trucks, big Benz. I don't even know what this is. Something incredible. Something incredible. This uh, Ford. Um, let's see. This would be a Gran Torino. This has 12 miles on it. This is a $50,000 car. Back here we have a uh, you know purse. A lot of these. See some more of those later. Dusty old DeLorean just chilling. Uh, we'll walk this way. Old Ford Business Coupe. Some other older American cars. Uh, some pretty cool stuff. There's all kinds of cars here. Japanese cars. American cars. Some Euros in the other room we'll go see. Over there. Original Superbird. 12 miles. Bunch of Toyota Crown V12s. Toyota Century V12s, my bad. Um, more American cars. And then there's also a lot of these very interesting cars here that you'll see. Um, these Ford Rangers, for example, are just regular old Ford Rangers. You don't think anything about it. This is a $12,000 car because it has nine miles on it. These are all super low mileage cars. Dots and pickups. Prowler, another DeLorean, just chilling. Cadillacs. Uh, Toyota pickups worth tons of money. All kinds of crazy things. Let's see. What else can we find? Chevy Love. More American cars. We got some Impalas. We've got Buick Century wagons. More Chevrolet trucks. These probably all have less than 100 miles on them. More trucks down there. We're going to cut through here. In between a Chevelle and a, let's see, Buick GS. Some Triumphs. 300 ZX. Um, that's a Bricklin, more American cars, some awesome Chrysler. Um, let's see, we will go down this, some Jeeps, old Jeeps. Those are all Mitsubishi made Jeeps from the 90s. In here we have a couple hundred Nissan Figaros, like this one, Toyota Serras with the Gullwing doors, um, a couple GTRs. Uh, four-door GTT, legit GTR, um, is this a GTST? What's this? Let's find out. This place is so cool. They're very friendly. You walk right in. You open doors if you want to. You sit behind the wheel of Skylines GTRs. This is a GTR. Incredible. I guess we need to open this one too. Let's see. Beautiful. Astonishing minis. Fire trucks. Um, don't even know what these are. Interesting. Honda Beats. I think there's like a hundred of those. On the other side are all the Nissan Figaros. I think there's a million dollars in Figaros here, I believe. I'm not positive. Um, a couple Nissan S car goes back there. Um, Mitsubishi Pajero, Dakar. Very cool. Let's see. Oh, here we have two cappuccinos, not the one that my friend is buying. Uh, this gold one is not for sale, and then this one needs a little bit of work. It's got some rust issues, but it's still an incredible car. Where is the hood latch? There it is. Three cylinder turbo, rear wheel drive. Very, very cool. All of these cars are amazing. Honda City, Figaro's. Man, so many Figaro's. Uh, what is that? Toyota Century Limousine? No. Some kind of Mazda. 
Nope, yep, it's a Century limousine. These are all Figaro's. So many Figaro's. A million dollars in Figaro's. $23,000, $25,000, 10 grand for a messed up one. All kinds of Figaro's. These are apparently very good investments, we were being told. They are only going up in value, and apparently people want these. I've never seen one on the road, to be honest, but apparently people really want these cars. So that's interesting. Here are those mini truck. They're Suzuki Carry fire engines, is what these are. We'll go look at one. Very cool. This vehicle is not for sale. These are so rad. Let's see. Yep, it's just a fire engine. Somebody would ride here. Very cool. Let's see here. More Figaro's. Um, somewhere there are some pretty badass cars that we need to go look at. And I don't remember. Oh, in here. AMC Gremlin. Here you go. Datsun 510 race car. This is a real race car from Japan. It's not a uh, resto mod. It's not something stupid. This is a real race car. About as cool as it gets. And it could be yours for 30 grand. Mitsubishi um, Jeeps. Gremlin. What do we got? S2000. Uh, over there, that Dodge truck. That's got, I think, two miles on it. And here's the good stuff. We have many hearses. These are incredibly intricate hearses. Beautiful. Now this wonderful gentleman that showed me around has said that I may enter and sit in any of these vehicles that I like. So we will sit in the NSX Camry. I always tell everyone to buy one of these. This looks like a pretty rare one. Let's see. Hmm, 100,000 miles. Keys are in it. Not a V6, but it has the leather interior. That's pretty cool. NSX. This car is incredible. Absolutely spectacular. I don't know what year this is. It is a 97. So that makes it a United States car. Very interesting door handle. Of course, we're going to get in. And it feels like you're in a spaceship. Badass. I don't know what else to say about this, but I think this is a private, private vehicle. I don't think it's for sale. I'm going to go as nice as I can to all these cars. I don't want to make anybody upset. Let's see what's over here. Nothing worth anything. Old Datsuns, Camry, more Minis. These are the Austin Minis. So these were sold in Japan as Japanese vehicles. And then you can, you, people import them here. 300 ZXs. These Volkswagens are some of the rarest cars here. We were told that this black car specifically has nine original miles and it's the only car that came with this specific set of options. This is probably a $100,000 car. Most of these bugs are worth somewhere in that area. 300 ZXs, Supra, we'll go see that. Let's see, I don't know, what do we got? It is a manual, it is a, let's go look at the tag. It's an early one because I can tell the tail lights. It's got a ding. It's a 94. That makes sense. It's pre-97 because it doesn't have the gray tail lights. It's a Targa. It has 57,000 miles on it. I don't believe it's a turbo. Let's get in. Well, it looks like it's a bit tight, so we're not getting in. But this is a Supra interior this is a six speed five speed car actually that's a six speed car i wonder if this is a turbo let's find out i cannot believe this nice man is just letting me walk around and touch all his cars 
hood release. Where are you? There we are. No. Wait. Yes, this is a turbo. So this is it. This is a 94 Toyota Supra Turbo in Super Red 2 with a six-speed manual. This is about the coolest car, in my opinion, that you can get. I'll close this very carefully. And continue on. Other cars of interest. I can read 3000 GT, a couple Porsches, more Datsuns, many Supras of all generations. Uh, this NSX, which I believe is actually for sale, I think. Oh, nope, not for sale. This is a 92 with 16,000 miles on it. So you know we're sitting in it. There we go. You see that? 16,000 original miles. Astonishing. This is just the coolest thing ever. We'll get out. Manufactured by Honda. Specifically, that number. Oh, I can't see it. Whatever. Um, very cool. Other one. This one is also Mercury, Lincolns. What do we got? More Benzes. This S 600 has a an interest. This is the V12 car. This has a I guess a lowering kit. It looks kind of odd, but whatever. Still cool. It's probably this a sixteen thousand dollar car, so it is what it is. More Benzes, three hundred ZX, um, Cadillacs, Eldorados. These are front wheel drive. So let's let's have a look. This car has. I don't know how many miles are on this car. This car has. 1,942 miles. Maybe not. Whatever. Eldorados, Del Sol's, uh, what looks like nothing special. I think this is a 328 or a 330 Beamer. Pretty sure. Let's see. Carmen Gia's, 325 CI, nothing special, but I'm pretty sure this car has like five miles on it. Really, just really incredible stuff. Rolls Royces, nothing special. Hood prop, there's that really freaking scary brake system. No one knows how to fix. Rolls Royce, engine bay. I guess we have to go inside, don't we? Keys are in it, keys are in every one of these. Wood grain interior probably be the only time I ever sit in a Rolls until like two years from now when I buy one. Just incredible, incredible cars. Back seat, not as surprisingly not that big, but it's not closed. Let's see, Del Sol, Volkswagen vans, that Westphalia I'm pretty sure is like a $30,000 truck, car van thing. $29,000 Rolls, limo tent. Oh, this is a hearse. Oh, that's pretty cool. I don't know if you guys can see this. This is a the track for the coffin. Very cool. Fits in with the hearse vibe. Head back to the office. I need to go drive the cappuccino to make sure everything is as it should be. So thanks for coming with me. Uh, AutoZam, AZ1. Um, you want to go ahead and get in? So this is what you were going to buy, am I right? I wish. Close the door, that's sick. <laughs> Amazing. Is it, does it feel tiny? I got plenty of room, being 5'6". Oh yeah, you're right, the dampers on this one aren't that great. I'm getting in though. Oh man, you sit over the, that thing. Oh Jesus Christ. All right, we'll have this one. Take us home. I could not sit in this car for four hours. It's actually pretty comfortable. It's yeah, I, I didn't sit in the passenger seat. It might not be all the way back. Got the spare? I think the dude. I think this seat's bolted to the floor. Yeah, there's no adjuster. You don't need adjusters where we're going. Yeah, what through time? Maybe. Yeah. Oh, this one's 
or am I looking at the wrong thing? I think I'm looking at the wrong thing. Oh, do you want to go sit in the DeLorean? They have two DeLoreans. What do you know about that? Well, I'm going to go look at the DeLorean. Uh, I think it's in too tight. I don't think you can get the gold wings open. Dude, we might as well just put this thing in our pocket and take it with us. I don't think I don't think we're gonna get into the DeLorean. The other one's under plastic, so I don't want to screw with it. Please do not touch. I will be respectful of that. It's like a bigger AZ1. It really is. Look at the window trim and this 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 Dodge Magnum is a eleven thousand dollar car apparently. It has no miles on it. That's why. I'm gonna get in the Gran Torino. Oh, dude, the bench seat is so real. Wow. Squire. I wonder what that means. Hmm. Cool. Let's go sit in NSX and stuff. K cars. What is this? Like a, is this a Ford? This is a business coupe, right? Yeah, a Ford business coupe. These are pretty sick. What? It has like, what, what? Look at that, it has seats from like a, like a Camry in it. Do you see that? That's weird. What is it like a full it? interior swap or something? Wow. Oh, well, I guess we didn't know what motor is in it. Where's the hood thingy? Oh God, I don't know. Uh, I'm dumb, I, I don't do a big American cars. I don't know about the fucking thing. Mm. Oh, it's already popped. Oh God, it weighs a ton. What is this? This is a uh, 350. It's a small block, right? Yeah, Edelbrock performer heads, really typical. Little, really typical little build. Stuff sitting up high because there's no space down there for all the, because it's got a factory AC, so there's no space for the air compressor or the alternator. Very cool. I want to slam this. Awesome. Stop. C3s. Many. I guess we'll sit in one because, you know, make people jelly. This one's an auto. So cool. When I was on the back end, placing back and, and, and leaning, because when she does that, I won't be driving fast. Oh, I bet. I'm going to be. Going fast, back and forth. Yeah. So we'll shake, shake her off, so I'll have to put her in the seat. <laughs> yeah. Put the seat belt tight. That, that one has two buffers facing down. Oh, yeah, it's got turn downs. That's pretty cool. Huh. Turn, I like the C4. You can't turn them up. You turn them up, Dude, I love this C4. Um, it's an put, auto. You could put another cool. row, put another, another pipe on it, going down. And I love the S2000s. These are sick. Oh, yeah. You, you like this. Well, how many times is that? You can put Honda F Series motors. As good as it gets. This is my kind of K car. Not small. Oh, the leather's hard as a freaking rock. Accelerator has an inch of travel before it hits the floor. Clutch has an inch of travel. Very different type of car. I don't want to take these out of gear. Because these are not, these aren't, these cars don't have the handbrake up. They're just sitting here. You can roll them around. I think that's the point. Very cool. Back to the Datsun 510 race car. I'll get in the driver's side because there's stuff on the passenger side. Awesome. I wonder, these are seats from something else. They almost look like um, uh, Chevy Cavalier seats. Oh man, 
this is the coolest thing. I would buy the hell out of this wink mirror. Oh, dude, this is the coolest freaking car. The pedal box, look at the pedal box. It's like, um, <laughs> dude, look at the clutch. This is the craziest clutch ever. You can... There's not a lot of engine in here. No, there's, well, no, this is a 1600 engine out of probably a 280Z. The water can touch the ground, too. KY, KYB oh. coilovers. I, look, I ITBs. Love I love the ITBs. That's so cool. I I, comes out of it. No, 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 no. That's where the air goes in. These are these are our carburetors. This car is not fuel injected. This is like an old race car from back I in the day. You probably close it if you want. Go get in one of these debts. 280Z, 280Z, 280Z. We'll get in this one. It has the most door space. What's in this? 2.8? Yep. Oh man, this is so cool. 280Z, Datsun. Uh, I don't know what year this is. This is a 76. And it feels like a 76. Dude, the gears in this are feel amazing. You gotta, like, they're very precise. I think it's a Toyota, what is this? This is a Century. Toyota Century V12 on on uh, Blizzak snow tires in the back seat with the we got a TV we got the climate control we have a high hygrometer and a temperature uh, thermometer a tell a tube television VHS VHS there's probably um a refrigerator yeah, there is because cool cool and hot box with ice maker oh wonderful up here is the look AC what are all these this is Japanese I don't know what this Japanese says. I have no clue. Partition glass, Rolls Royce clock. Dude, this is dope. I could roll around to like northern Japan in the mountains. In the back of here, lace curtains. Oh, dude, look. The seat has a massage. This is the buttons to operate the seat massage. How do you open the door? Look at that, see? Slow massage, fast massage. I don't know, Japanese. Are these the lights? Oh, fuck. I don't want to, like... This pro Honestly, I think a lot of these have the batteries disconnected. Probably. This is my comfort... This is, like, where I would put it? Yeah. Here's the back. I can't... I'm all the way back, and I'm uncomfortable. Yeah, like, two inches. It's in here in Honda Beats. Honda Beat City over here. How many Beats are this? Like... There's at least 30. Dude, there's, like, 100. Look at all these beats. Look at this rice wing on the one in front of me. Hilarious. Does yours have the key, dude? All these cars have the key. R32 GTR with like the real pink HKS filters on the turbos. This is so cool. Looks like an eBay strut bar. So cool. Real car. Actually, it's probably not an eBay strut bar. It's EVSG strut bar. Even cooler. Even freaking cooler. I... Whatever reason. They just buy the fire trucks. Apparently, Do they use them? Apparently, a guy up in Maine bought them. Like, to use? He owns like a ski resort and he's gonna like put tracks on it and stuff? Dude, these are cool. You can tell they're like after the fact because they're all, all the interiors on them are white. So they painted them red like after the fact. Yeah, these are cool. All the little high jets. This is a Lisa. What is this? Is this a Suzuki? What's this? I don't know. This is a. This would be a Turbo EFI Daihatsu Lisa Spider. It has 237 miles. I don't want to get in with my snowy feet, but it's as clean as it gets. There's a lot of cool, oh dude, GT4 Celica. So this is turbocharged and all wheel drive. I s oh, interesting. Look, look at that dude. Yeah. Yeah, this is a, a twin, whoops, a twin turbo or a single turbo, twin cam. 
two liter. This is uh, this is a, a 3S GTE engine, which is the same engine that comes in the turbo MR2s, like mine. Ugh, this is, I need this in my life. These are so cool, dude. I want one of these so bad. So this is also all wheel drive. Is it? Yeah. Damn. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, only that, so the, the GT we got in America, the GT4 is all wheel drive. And we didn't get the GT4 here. Cadillac limousine. <laughs> More Figaro's. Oh, these are cool. Have you seen? Aren't deemed good enough to sit inside? Pretty wrecked. Put that deal out here. Del Sol. See, most, a lot of these aren't imports. A lot of these are. I mean, a lot of them are, but. CRX, another, oh look, another MR2. Dude, I love the mini trucks. <laughs> Dude, find one where the driver's side's open and get the FD. So it's just sitting outside. I know, I love the Mighty Boy, those are sick. Check this out, this is just sitting out here. Have you ever sat in an RX-7 before? Yeah, I've only sat in one once. And it was not a, and it was not an imported one. It was one from here. Sick. Spark, real OG Sparkos with center nuts. It's pretty sick. Toyota Previas. I want a high ace van. Like I don't know why. I just do. These are so cool, dude. I love the high ace vans. Those are so cool. Dude, these, these Enkis with the single center nut, these are probably like $3,000 wheels just on this car. It's the factory one. Yeah, I know the one you're talking about. Yeah, I agree. I don't like the no spoiler look. What's this? I think this is an Isuzu. It's got, dude, every one of these cars has sick wheels. These are like Advan RCs. Like, you, 7,900 bucks, these are like $3,000 wheels. I don't know, like, everybody thinks these are so cool. I don't know why. Oh, there's another FD. This MR2 is cool. It's a 3S non-turbo. I know. There's that FD. Yeah, I like... This is the later wing. I think this is like the 94 plus wing or something like that. I don't know. Yeah. This one has the way cleaner interior. And it's got the... Dude, every one of these has a boost controller. What wheels are on this? Of course. Every one of these cars has sick wheels. I wish my... That's honestly not that bad. I'd consider it, I guess. Is that a Mitsubishi Starion? Yeah, it is. That's pretty cool. I do like this FD. Let's, I guess we have to. Yep, stock. But it's clean, like... None of these are ever this clean. How many miles are on this one? Uh, uh, 41,100. 41,100? What? Oh, it's been repainted. You can tell because they painted the fucking these shits. Oh, why wouldn't you? Because they're not supposed to be painted. Uh, this MR2. Just look at the wall. Dude, it's got the dildo shifter in all its glory. I have to sit in one because I've driven mine all over creation and I need to know, bless you, it feels exactly the same. Except this has, when, wait, what? Oh, look, this has a roll bar. I want this roll bar. But the seats don't fit, you see? They hit the roll bar. I might do. 
feels exactly like mine. <laughs> Just borrow that. <laughs> funny. Yeah, that's funny. All the same. Same. We're probably not gonna get that before I don't care. We'll fix your car good enough, and then we'll just drive it back, and it'll be okay. Another Celica. That one's a not all-wheel drive. Is. These are the units of the, uh... This is not a Unos. This is a Subaru um, SVX. It doesn't have fancy doors. Because it's stupid. That's why. Those didn't sell very well. They're not very good cars. Supras. Mitsubishi Pajaros. I don't know what this is, some kind of Nissan thing. Other Nissan thing. Hondas. More Nissans. You satisfied? Honda Element. <laughs> Toyotas. These are cool. I love all these Land Cruisers. Like a lot of these are like, like off-road builds from back in the day. What is it? Oh yeah, I love starlets. These are so sick. I didn't know they had one of these here. Get in. Of course, it's on OG Sparkos from Japan. Coolest shit of my life. My door's locked. Boo. Yo, I just learned about these recently. Dude, these look like at that. <laughs> yeah, no, these are sick. Open the hood. I think this has a. Oh, it is. I think this has a 3S GTE motor. I think. Yeah. There we go. Yep, look, 3S GTE. Look, it's on coilovers. It's on, what are those? Oh, like legit blitz coilovers. You can't get more real than that. That's just like a. <laughs> Dude, that's a. Um, I used to know what that's called. It's a blitz summer or something. Shit, if I knew this, I might have spent like. How much is this? 11. Uh, this is way too unsafe to drive, though. Look at that. Yeah, that tire is shot. You cannot drive that. You have to throw this at it. This FC is sick. And it was clearly a race car because it has harnesses in it. I'm going to laugh when it's a small block Chevy. <laughs> nope. It is not an LS. But that's okay. Look, it's on the same Blitz coilovers as the uh, Celica is. Dude, every one of these cars has fire wheels. Got an awesome Momo steering wheel. It's probably legit. Let's see. We're getting in. Oh, I love the the drift wing. I'm surprised. Why is it this one? Do not touch it, says. Okay, I won't. I'm getting in, though. Ugh. All right. Race car. Let's see. Gear stick. Feels like a gear stick. Blitz turbo thing, don't know what that is. Water temp, I guess, uh, oil temp? That's weird, why does it only go up to 150? Oh, Celsius, duh. I was like, why does it only go up to 150? It doesn't make sense. Dude, this seat is like so comfortable. This is what I want in the MR2. The only problem is this seat's like 2,000 bucks. Yeah, that'll happen. Yeah, it sure will. It's all the way back and I'm still not comfortable. <laughs> G-Wagon Benz. What is it? It's like a two-door G-Wagon Benz. What? That's weird. I don't get it. It is a 91 Mercedes G320. Yeah. With a lot of kilometers on it. But it's a G-Wagon. It doesn't look any different. Like, you can buy these today. Like, brand new. And they look exactly the same. That's super weird. Side pipes. This, there's no way this is open. Never mind. This is Mike's cappuccino that he just bought with really dry rotted tires that hopefully don't kill you on the way home. It'll be fine. Pop the hood. What do you mean if you can? It's your car. You can do whatever you damn want.